First responders, newsrooms, and anybody else who signed up with the Northern California Seismic Network now know there was no swarm of earthquakes in the Bay Area early this morning. More than 100,000 alerts went out just the same. But as Comfort's Rob Flatabo reports, the only real quake was the one that struck halfway around the world. The head scratching began just after 7 this morning when seismographs like this one picked up five moderate earthquakes around Northern California. Earthquakes that nobody felt. It turns out they were false positives triggered by a real 7.4 magnitude quake in the Marianas Islands off Sumatra. Because the quake was centered 160 miles beneath the ocean, the shaking fooled sensors here in California. Like the stone in a puddle and the waves are emanating from a point, and the software knows how to handle that. Here's something coming in from the side, sweeping across the ray. So the pattern, the arrival time pattern, when the energy sweeps across all the stations, doesn't look like a California earthquake. But we've taught the software, you see an earthquake, try and locate it in California. Among the ghost quakes was a 3.8 tembler along the San Andreas Fault in Marin, a 4.1 shaker along the Hayward Fault, the others south and west of the Bay Area. The Northern California Seismic Network detected the quake on hundreds of sensors, relaying the information in thousands of text messages to individuals and OES networks across the region. So it did exactly what we developed it to do but it doesn't handle earthquakes on the other side of the world because it's tuned only for a local problem. Bottom line, no harm done. The scientists say the episode is proof we still have a lot to learn about earthquakes. Somewhat embarrassed, they say they're working on that software, but they also say better that the public be alerted to earthquakes that don't exist than not find out about the real thing. In Menlo Park, Rob Flatabo, Cron 4 News.